We're ready to go for Rinai. This is a the wow. chance of a million-dollar mark. Luke Darcy, take it away. Yeah, thank you, Jim. Uh, we're out on the Hello Turf at the MCG, and a unique moment in Triple M football. I'm standing alongside a man by the name of Tim Robinson. He's from Ballarat. Uh, grew up as a Bulldog supporter and alongside him is a man known as the King, the greatest player in the history of the game and the Duck is going to launch a drop punt to the goal square. Timmy, all you need to do, my friend, is stand under. It's not a hard thing to take a mark, but we've got a bit of sideways rain coming in. There's a swirling breeze at the MCG. This is going to be a massive moment for you, Tim, unless you muck it up. Yeah, well, that's the, uh, the big question, isn't it? So, so much to think about other than just a simple mark. But uh, as I said earlier today, uh, if the Duke can, uh, yeah, sorry, if the Duck can get it to the top of the square... I'll look after it. We've got the Collingwood Cheer Squad behind you here. They're ready to roll and just get right into this one. Let's have a quick word from the King. You've got to go out to 50. You dominated out here on the MCG. This is your home. Uh, what sort of punt kick are we uh, looking at here, please, Wayne? Uh, just be a drop punt. I'm a little bit worried about the distance, though. So if I was you, Tim, stand at the front of the square, not at the back of the square. We don't need you to run that far. So hopefully I'll just lob it uh, to the top there and Tim does the rest. All right, we're going to send the King out to 50. We're going to clear the decks here on the MCG. Uh, Timmy has picked out his footy. He's picked out number 63 of 100. And if that one is the million-dollar footy, the man I'm standing alongside of here is looking at a million dollars. He's guaranteed $10,000 thanks to Triple M footy. So get behind him here at the G. Oh, Duke. Have a look at the king goes out. He strides into position. He's 55 out. And look at the shape the king's in. He could not be in better, Nick. He's oiled up. What about his pants, Duke? He's got the three quarters on, <laughs> Not on. It's unprecedented. Here we go. Here's Big Timmy. He's in the square underneath. And I love the style. The oh, oh, it's you, oh, oh, no. oh, He's come kicked on. the sack, the yeah, king. He's kicked the sack, the king, and shaked it. Now this one comes in. Timmy's under it for a million dollars. Yeah. Oh, the big boys take it out. Yeah. 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 Tony Luckett style. Get around him. He got the jukes out. He got it on the chest. The king gives him a high five. The crowd loves it here at the MCG. Let's get over to Timmy. Oh, no. And we're going to get the envelope out because Ooh. the number 63 footy, Timmy, well done. You handled that nicely. No, first one from you, Wayne. Oh, 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 oh. Well, I popped out, dude. deliberately kicked it off the side of my boot then and then just put the next one in. Just for a little bit of theatre, Timmy, you've done all you could do. The king kicked it down. You took it on the chest. You picked the number 63 footy my friend why did you do that uh yeah um it's pretty much number six is my number and the three was just in for good luck she's excited duke yeah he's just really uh <laughs> enamored with the whole process timmy here alongside me i've got an envelope mate that may have a million dollars on it. you open it up oh here we go thanks oh, to triple m footy and red eye come on we've man. guaranteed timmy from ballarat via windham vale he grew up a lifelong bulldog supporter oh. he's been out here on the hello turf he's just taken a mark from the king let's open it up what have you got in front of you timmy the winner is any time you're ready, Timmy. <laughs> Ten grand, you you ten thousand dollars. So that's you don't sneeze at ten thousand dollars. Put your hands together. Oh, that's hey, it. Hey, Duke. Yes, Gaz. There's no chance that first one that skewed off the side was a million bucket, was it? <laughs> <laughs> Have a look at the king. He nearly, he nearly missed it all together, which is a touch embarrassing. But, Timmy, you handled it beautifully. Yeah, thanks for that. Uh, I was a bit worried about it there. and swirling around a bit. But, uh, yeah, got lucky enough to get on it. Anyone you'd like to thank, uh, Timmy? Um, really like to thank Renai for putting it on. Um, hot breakfast and Triple M. Um, yeah, really uh, appreciative of everything that you've done for over the week. What about the king alongside of you? Just put it lace out. Yeah, duck, it went to plan, mate. So, uh Thank you very much for that. Well done. Timmy, our man down here, Tim Robinson, $10,000 richer thanks to Triple M footy. Nice work. Back to you, boys. Uh, well done down oh, there, Duke. Geez. Nicely handled. Jim, did you have a good oh. close look at the mark? Uh, he, he, he was... <laughs> Nearly yeah, bobbled. He, 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 he sucked that footy right in. <laughs> can, what I tell you, can I tell you? What? Duck would be so flat oh, mate, first. Yeah. Hey, and don't anyone, he would have been don't anyone for a second think that he meant to do he that. He did not. That nah. is, in fact... I'd go as far as to say that's almost, almost his most embarrassing moment, moment yep. in footy, <laughs> out on the ground. And it's taken till now, Jim. Uh, You're well, a great hero. He's no. gone and shanked one. Yeah, <laughs> I, I, I didn't like the way he hit that first one. No. <laughs> <laughs> oh, 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 come on. <laughs> uh, well, well, you know what I think? Well, I think the nerves got to I did it. I think the nerves got to <laughs> the, well, great, well, the great man. We need to find that out. Uh, 10000 bucks is a wonderful thing for Tim Robinson. Well done. All right, we're going to take a break for Coach Hire. Back yeah, with the footy just preview. before you go, Rob, off Triple M said, Duke's jacket's a bit shit. <laughs> oh, oh, no. This has become an open pot. He said, this is what Chief brings to our show. He's just come back and promoted the whole mindset of openly going, folks. You're next.
Well, you better bring your best game, Chief. A miss it'll do. <laughs> You'll go down like a sack off. <laughs> You've underwhelmed today. Come on, Jim. Now, Gaz, I would never profess to jump on your territory. You oh, are the social media guru. Oh, I haven't really, yes. But I've had handed to me yes. a tweet from our good friend Jay-Z. I just saw him down there. I'll tell you what. AC, you want to be careful. The tweet says, Great to hear Gaz has a bit more enthusiasm in his voice tonight. Flat last week, Chew carried him. Well, what I can tell you now, exclusively on Triple M, <laughs> Jay-Z has had three buckets of fish and chips down there, and he's having a pot off with Mark Stevens. Oh, Having a what off? A pot off. Just uh, around the pot gut off. Is the it pot gut off. That's the word coming out of the uh, out HWT of the... building. I don't like it. I think he's. I think he's better than that. But uh, that's what's coming out. So uh, straight, Jim. Personal. If he's going to be one of ours, tidy up your act. Well, I don't mind him having a go at you, Gary. That shows no. he's got some presence. No. But uh, well, he needs that game to back it up. Yeah. Little Jay Z Clark. Um, we need to. In, in case you've already, you've, uh, appears to me, I've been out of the box for a while. Did we get to the actual ball that had the million dollars? Yeah, he was ten off it. So he picked sixty-three. It was seventy-three. Seventy-three. And right. that was a, a very interesting experience being out there because the king. He was a touch nervous, the King. I, I well, promise saw you that. With his first, his kick. first one barely uh, made Shank. any connection at all. And uh, before I got him, before I got the headphones on, he says, "The boys are under my tights." <laughs> <laughs> oh, <laughs> he said, "The zipper broke." I swear right. to God, I said, I, "I think they might have something to say about that." The King. How does the zipper turn three quarter tights into long tights? Well, too? he said he slid them up after the zipper broke. But how does the zipper break on both legs? That's <laughs> yeah, he, he, choked, he choked tonight. The duck. <laughs>